Welcome to the introductory video in which you can get information about Karsan IATA's quick user manual. How to start IATA In order to start IATA, firstly, master switch must be in open position. Turn the master switch to open position. Then open service cover which is located near front bumper. Push the button for opening front doors. Afterwards, step on brake pedal and turn on the ignition key. Digital cluster will be displayed automatically in 5 seconds. Press the HV button. In the lower right corner, blue battery sign appears. Then make sure that ready is displayed on the digital cluster. Before driving IATA, please check vehicle suspension level is in drive position. Then shift to D and release the park brake lever. Now you are ready to enjoy the drive. How to shut down IATA Press brake pedal, then shift to end position. Activate park brake lever. Turn off the ignition key halfway. Make sure that ready text on the digital cluster goes off. Turn off ignition key completely. Afterwards, press the HV off button. Push the button for closing doors. Open service cover and turn off the master switch. There is no need to turn off the master switch if the vehicle will not be shut down for a long time. How to charge IATA Open charging plug cap that is located on the right side of the vehicle. Put the charging cable into the charging plug. You may charge IATA up to 150 kW DC power through plugging connection. You can check the status of charge of the batteries from digital cluster. Mirror cameras In IATA, we use state-of-the-art mirror cameras. They will be activated when you turn on ignition key. These high-tech mirrors provide clearer vision at night compared to standard mirrors. Thanks to the mirror cameras, the turning radius of the vehicle is shortened. Also, with its aerodynamic structure, there is a decrease in electric consumption. You have a wider angle of view with this technology. Advanced Driving Assistance Systems Advanced Driving Assistance System provides four types of safety alerts, which are pedestrian collision warning with bicycle detection, urban forward collision warning, lane departure warning, and headway monitoring and warning. 